All right, you have the instructions on how to download the hksetup.exe file. Uh, what do you do once you get it? Well, here I have my uh, hksetup.exe file. You notice I also have an HTML kit folder. Um, if you're on the campus in the CPT 114 uh, folder on Lab Notes on Tate in the computer lab, you can just grab this folder and drag it onto your USB drive and use this if you wish. But if you're at home, you'd want to install it on your home computer. So you just double click on hksetup.exe and then say yes. Uh, and then say next. And then they want to know if they want if you want to give them your firstborn male child and you say yes. And where you want to put it, and that's fine. And then let's see. Well, let's just go ahead and we'll throw the whole thing on there. And then we'll have that. And then we'll install. Okay, it doesn't take that long, it's a pretty small fold file. And it's going to go ahead and put it on there. And then when we finish, uh, we'll go ahead and finish this up. And then I'll go to the Start menu and simply go ahead and start up uh, HK uh, HTML Kit. Um, if you have it on your USB drive, what you want to do is you want to double-click on HTML Kit, double-click on Bin, then double-click on the HTMLKit.exe file. Now, this won't install the the uh, software, it'll just run the software, which is why if I tell the students in the classroom, this is what you want to just run it from your USB drive. It's the easiest way to do it. Uh, it runs the same way on the computer as it does the stick. It's going to come up and ask you some questions. Uh, if you install it on your own computer, it'll ask those questions just once. If you do it on your stick, it'll ask it every time you open up the software. Uh, the answer to all the questions is no. So just remember, same as uh, use, using drugs, just say no, and you'll say no to all the an all the questions that they ask you. Um, and it's asking me here if I want to run it, so that you say yes to. Uh, other than that, all of them you just say no. I was wondering why it wasn't coming up. All right, so it's going to go ahead and pop up, and here it is. And you want to say no, 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 no. Um, you might want to go ahead and say yes to all the questions um, on your installing it, because it's going to go out and it's going to give you all the um, updates and everything else. Okay, when it comes up, you can say open a file, or you can just hit the white button here. Uh, now, notice that it's coming up with HTML, and that's because this is HTML kit, not JavaScript kit. So to, we want to first get rid of all the text here, and you can hold down the control key and press the letter A and then press the delete button on your keyboard and now everything is gone and now we want to go ahead and start up uh, JavaScript and we do that by clicking on the objects tab and then going on to the button bar and clicking the JS um, button on there when you click on that it puts the start and stop text for JavaScript and everything else we'll be doing is in between those two tags Okay. Uh, when you're done, so suppose I just type something in here uh, I'll do file and save to save this file and what I want to do is when I go ahead and save it say I save it onto my USB drive I'm going to change this to um, whatever HTML file it's going to be so I'm going to say uh, lesson 1.html you want to end with HTML or HTML and then save the file All right, then when we um, say we're done with this, we want to come back and look at it again. We simply go to the file and then open file and then find our lesson one or whatever lesson we had and it opens right back up. Okay, that's it.